Hello and welcome. Chumpy coming at you once again with some more Paper Sorcerer, the new game that we're going to play. Uh, I don't really know much about it, so let's dive in and go along for the ride. Uh, probably just put it on normal. Not looking for an insane game. Once there was a sorcerer who lived in a tower with an apprentice. The sorcerer terrorized the land with evil minions until one day they roamed no more. At night, however, lights could still be seen burning in the windows of the dark tower. The king saw this was his chance to attack the sorcerer directly. He gathered four loyal and highly skilled subjects, entrusting them with a powerful artifact. An artifact that would seal away the sorcerer, ending this reign of terror once and for all. On the way, the group traversed dark caves, poisonous marshes, and ancient ruins. They climbed the dark tower floor by floor, beset by evil minions at every step. Once they reached the top, they confronted the sorcerer and activated the artifact. In a blinding flush of light, sorcerer and minions were all sealed away. However, that is just the beginning of our tale. You don't get to play as those badasses. You awaken with a start, reflectively trying to cast a spell that dies in your throat when you see your surroundings. The last thing you remember was fighting four of the king's lapdogs. Oh, so we're playing as the sorcerer, I guess. And then the warrior. Resherish the ranger. Emi the mage, and y Yoran the priest. I had a book that glowed with a fearsome light. You aren't the type to be easily scared, but as you looked into that light, you felt truly terrified like you never have before. But you have all your arms, legs, fingers, and senses intact, so things could always be worse. In checking you are intact, you confirm you are a man. The first thing you could figure out you should do is find out where you are. Where's to move? Look about with a mouse. Click on things to interact with. Alright. Oh, that's a pretty neat art style. Advanced dialogue, press spacebar, we can hit escape. The search will appear and we can spacebar to search. Alright. So the story leaves something a little to be lacking, but find out. Even though you've only been conscious for a short amount of time, you feel extremely tired. You want to rest for a bit? Nah. Soldier on despite the fatigue. Search. Little force in this room, my head feels all fuzzy. I guess we're imprisoned inside the sphere or something. Saying, hey, you should sleep. Alright. You're being watched. You have a dream when you're talking with some friends you had when you were younger, but the room you're talking in is unfamiliar with plain stone walls and a table with several bags on it. When you open the bag in the center, a snake jumps out and slithers out of the room. When you awaken, there's a mouse sitting on the end of your bed, staring at you. You're an interesting one! A sorcerer! That's some dark magic! Finding souls and calling them when needed? That can be a dangerous power. Dangerous, but useful. What do you want? I've been waiting for someone like you. I would like to escape, and I think you can help me. Right now, you've been sealed inside a prison of sorts. The king has been trapping threats to the kingdom here for decades of sorts. Love that phrase, of sorts. I mean, just, just, yeah, it was just prison. Not of sorts. I think I know a way to escape, but I can't do it alone, and a sorcerer like you is just what I need. If you would be willing to help me, I would be sure to ensure we both get out. I would, oh, I would be able to ensure we both get out. Uh, I don't know how much I trust a talking mouse. Oh, very well. Feel free to run in here. It's your last chance. I will be back. Will you help me? Yeah. Excellent. The first thing you need to do is get out of this cell block. Only a person of intense magic fills the room. The oppressive force that was draining your magic is gone, as is the mouse. You hear a whispery voice in your mind. I will find you again soon! Alright. Oh! Cool. You feel some of your power returning, you may summon one of your former thralls to aid in your escape. Choose wisely, they will function as your party for the rest of your adventures here. So we don't actually fight, we get uh, people to fight for us. Um. So to start with, let's... I don't think trolls are deadly assassins. Let's go for... let's just start with a, a minotaur. 
His brute force to cause severe damage to the enemy ranks. Just a big old tank. Powerful axes, faster strength growth. You can only wear light armor, but he also has lots of HP. Cleave, and he can red armor. Axes, light armor, one accessory. Yeah, sure. Well. Single guard. Hey, you! How'd you get out of your cell? Huh? Hello! <laughs> the door kind of just opened by itself. <laughs> Most turn based. Select the option with the okay. space bar. G is used for skills. Not using it outside of battle. Skills. Got a dice. Tell us recharge. Music is a bit loud. Ah, uh, both me and my sword, me and my minotaur. Minotaur can damage level. Ah, uh, oh, this is one that can hit everybody. And the sorcerer has. Him. Okay. A leather helmet. Put that on a Minotaur, hopefully. Sure, I guess. Also, right now, for some reason, he's called a Berserker rather than being called. Helmet counts as an accessory. Uh, snoring. Inhuman intelligence, probing my mind. Intelligible. Yeah, I like the art style in this game. It's pretty neat. I can't press shift to run, unfortunately. Ooh, just notice the the darkness around the sides of the screen. Door is sealed and won't open. The purple start to get a headache. Barking, not human. So this must be some sort of secret magic prison. All right, let's go. Uh, looks like we got doors to either side and equipment. We got some fat loot. What might a ring might be useful? We'll tie people up. Locked chest. Uh, can examine it. Plain lock. Just, I reckon I'll smash it. Oh yeah, no shit. We have to. And I need a. You need to need to find a lockpick. Uh, right armor. All right, so we just got some basic stuff. Closer. Let's go. Spell damage. Nice. Rags on. Minotaur can put axe and rags as well. Alright, so we got skills. So the bull rush is the error attack, and then I guess brutal strike is. is the. One second. I'm just going to. All right, that's, that should be better. Uh, brutal strike is armor shred. The status, everybody's fine. We can summon. Oh, I guess we can just manually summon, and we'll get more slots later. We can save. All right, let's get out of this prison, shall we? Offside first. Guards. All right. HP, energy. Defense is subtracted from any damage. Okay. 
was done with each hit restored after battle. So I think we have, I got three armor and then I've given the Minotaur the rags and also a helmet. So he's got nine armor. All right, fight. Uh, so we've got three energy. So now it's probably worth using the bull rush because it takes everybody. And I can just smack one of them with my... Alright. I took off three of my defense. And it's only six damage per... Alright. Nah, uh, let's just zap that guy, I guess. Can I go back? No. Ouch and ouch. Zap! We should be dead. Minotaur, get him. Nice. Uh, three wooden coin. Uh, no, let's not go to the next level yet. So I guess this is a game where you need to just fight each level of the tower. Nothing around here, and it's nice the three D models. I'll search the bed, tiny bed. Examine it. Small dusty box. A small idol. A return female. There's a okay. Uh, anything? Can we open the bed? <gasps> Freshly cut. Okay, I'm, I'm kind of put out by this bed now. A mop and a broom. Peaceful path, learning to put banditry behind you. <laughs> I steal it. <laughs> and I found a key, so I can probably use that. What's this? Oh, I just use the bed. So a, t a tiny bed. I mean, it's much larger than a mouse bed would be. So I don't think it'd be the mouse's. But we can. Use this key. Thank you. Four restoration crystals. On the way to revive dead characters. Restore HP as well as resurrect. Okay. So like Phoenix Downs. Um, I just want to check out this equipment or items. Usable. Okay, so we have four of them. I don't know how much. HP it brings back. Uh, okay, so they're not usable, but I would probably sell them. It doesn't look like we have an inventory space, so we may as well just take everything we find. I mean, we are evil. Alright, let's go. <laughs> nice calm little music. Alright, let's get a... Curse and debuffs and things. And then we will get a high physical damage character as well. Uh, heal body based on max energy and burn somebody with. Uh, so it's a damage over time. Let's equip. We can put some rags on her, but that's about it. Oh, this is, this is the guy with his, uh, with his sexy goblin model. A mouse? I think it's really interesting. Uh, the spirit of the book. The who of the what? And over his shoulder and a magical, yeah. So we're stuck inside this artifact. Book that isn't really a book at all. More like it's an extra dimensional space. It's used by heroes under orders for the king to imprison an evil and maintain peace in the realm. So we get evil such as you and I. When someone or something is put here, we're supposed to go into a deep sleep for all eternity, dreaming of dreams of madmen. But, as we know that it wasn't always the case, sometimes it's both designed to step up how I don't work. Other times, the spirit of the book has been known to interfere. Either way, the result is usually the same, an inmate escapes and the guards hunt them down the relish the excitement. Okay, so... The book wants me to escape. Uh, there's an inmate who escaped. 
You can see the outside wall. Which what gems? Currency, sort of diamond. Yeah. Flash of light, something saying a bathroom sink. You'll give me a a middle-aged man staring back at you. <laughs> oh, and a nice single use. Through the cell block, a dark pit, jump into it, and I'll oh, end up the sanctuary. Watch out for the night, he's in charge. But I mean, I can't see guards to avoid them. Oh, there you go. Floating cloud of shadow. Ah, there you go. Oh, yeah. Alright. So, our uh, witch. Oh, she got a bunch of skills. Uh, but it doesn't look like she can do that fire thing. Is that only against a single? Yeah. This is fine. I can attack the squire, have the sorcerer, black bolt with guard. And mentor can attack the other one. Oops. Didn't mean that. Ah. Come on, Minotaur. Get him. Probably a good thing I did have the Minotaur attack by accident. Alright, we're fine. Minotaur, take him out. Let's. Is that the squire? I have the witch. Uh, let's go Phantom Grass just to see what it's like. I don't think she'll get a chance to there. Oh, the squire can take a beating, huh? I thought he would be weaker. There he goes. Scrap of leather and a leather helmet. Level 2. Let's get level 1 focus. Alright. 18 gems, jeez. Empty glass bottle, less of healing potion, nice. Another empty. I see you, I see you, graphical glitch. So, oh, I was going to say so we can get around, but I guess these guys were hiding. Um, I just realized our sorcerer has quite low health. Let's... Black Bolt, a scout. I guess this must have been a... It's not telling us, hey, uh... Sometimes people won't show up! Let's heal the sorcerer. It's fine. It's fine. Sippy zap. Front and back. Oh, I'm take a beating. Significant heal. Nice. Uh, let's go for a phantom grasp. Need to walk and just attack. I'll just. Let's just attack. Just grab him by the nuts. Damn, that's a lot of damage, dude. Uh, we can give that dagger to somebody. We got some neat items. Oh, I guess I counted. I guess we were just close enough. Alright, let's put her... 
I think if I have the cape, then I'll put the helmet on my sorcerer. Um, let's just go with the dagger, just because it's better than not. Uh, the axe is still crap. Okay, I'm good. That's an out. All we have left is to check out this room. Could be somebody in here to attack me, to teach me. Nice. Now what do we got? Another healing potion. Some smoker. A spat. A cabinet. Some more gems. A sack of dirt. I guess that's it. I'll head on to the next level. And I think with this, that's a good intro to the game. Uh, I'll most definitely keep on playing, and thanks for watching. If you look in my description, you can see links to both my Twitter and my Twitch, where I stream every weekday and most weekends. And I hope to see you again. Don't forget to subscribe.